We sold our house and essentially all of our material belongings except for our tools and our RV and we left. We had bought 73 acres out in West Virginia. It was about 13 acres of pasture surrounded by 60 acres of woodlands. For the first nine weeks, we had no running water, no septic, and no drawings for the house. Just a plan in our head of what we wanted our future home to look like. But we were happy and we were determined. We want the experience of doing this, um, what many people would say the hard way. <laughs> We're gonna learn so much and we're gonna make tons of mistakes and it's gonna be challenging, but this is what we've been dreaming of. Oh, how yeah. about that? Mm -hmm. <laughs>
Painting the house, getting the beams up, and finishing the fireplace really made it feel like home. It was cozy inside, and there was just nothing like that first fire burning in the wood stove. There's never a dull moment with me and Erin. We could be doing the most mundane project and I'll start breaking up my dancer shoes and busting moves and she eats it up. <laughs> we always have fun. It doesn't matter if it's dark and we're on a lift or if we're framing up a wall. It's always a good time. Time passes fast. These two years could have been spent back in Virginia. Wonder if we could do it. Instead of wondering, we decided to live our life, go for our dreams, and move out to West Virginia and build the life that we wanted. We got the kitchen cabinets done, we got the loft done for the boys, the entire house got device, and life seemed like it started getting back to normal. Getting the boys set up in the loft was a priority for us. At this point, we're two years into the build and we've come so far, but there's still so much left for us to do. The interior is still not done and we have the bedroom wing of the house to add on, which is a whole new build that we haven't even begun yet. We have a long ways to go, but we'll get there. Winter is coming. We have a lot of work to do. As the development of our property has gone on, we've slowly gotten comforts back, little by little. As kids, we were both very fortunate to grow up with lights at the flick of a switch and running water whenever you turn the knob on a sink. And after being without those things for so long here, it's like, oh, we just, you can't believe it. It's made us appreciate all those little creature comforts so much more. Hey boss. Dig it. I dig it.
Yeah. We got trees falling everywhere. Take this. It's been two years now since we moved out here. We've come so far, but there's still so much more that needs to be done. We took the risk and made the leap to live a life that fulfills us and allows us to have this time together as a family. It's about working together, struggling together, growing and succeeding at building the life that we want. We have our work cut out for us, don't we? We got a lot of work to do. <laughs> Good work, fun projects, right? I've been waiting so long for the storm to arrive. I know that is in you. I know that is in you. Dancing away with the world in your eyes. Oh, goodbye, Virginia. Goodbye, Virginia.